Today's Daily Idea is brought to you by DailyHub.com. Hi, I'm Nikki, and you're watching The Daily Idea. So after months of blood, sweat, and tears, you got your big bad website up and running. You're posting new content like a madman, and all indications show that you're ready to take the world by storm. However, you've discovered a slight problem. Nobody's showing up at your site. I tell you what, Google your website and write down how many pages you had to go through before you finally found your site. Or did you even find it at all? And therein lies your problem. Your Google ranking doesn't put you near the top of the list. That's what the daily idea is here for. Today, we'll show you how to improve your Google ranking in less than 30 minutes. So now, instead of your viewers getting sidetracked to someone else's site, the Information Superhighway will have an off-ramp right at your doorstep. Number one, submit your website to major directories. The Daily Idea suggests DMOZ and Joant. DMOZ is the open directory project and is the largest, most comprehensive human edited directory on the web. Think of it as the yellow pages of the internet. Joant is a similar directory of websites that specializes in giving its users the most relevant results for their searches. If you haven't submitted your site to them, these are your first two stops. Number two, use descriptive page structures. Like most users, research engine robots spend most of their time scanning rather than reading information on websites. Well-designed headings and page titles help the robots recognize what's on the page. Think of it this way. If you're selling Daily Ideas newest DVD, but it is located on a page titled DVDs to use as coasters, then Google may not know it's there. However, if the page is titled Daily Idea DVD, then your page will make it to the top of the list. Well, at least below our link. Number three, use a sitemap. Sitemaps tell the Google crawlers which pages are most important on your website. Sitemaps are easy to build and there are several free builders on the web. Once you have the sitemap file, you can submit it directly to Google for a more timely response. Number four, do some research on your keywords. Keywords are the quick, easy reference points for research engines and web crawlers to identify what's on your website. You may think you know what your ideal keyword should be, but most people who do a little investigating find there are some suggestions out there they didn't think of. The Daily Idea suggests visiting WordTracker and SEObook.com. WordTracker.com is a subscription-based keyword research engine that scans your site and offers suggestions to optimize your site for better results. SEObook.com also offers a keyword tool, and unlike WordTracker, SEObook is free. There are many other ways to improve your Google ranking and we couldn't possibly mention them all here. For more ideas, The Daily Idea recommends purchasing Aaron Wall's SEO book. As a shameless self-promoter, Aaron acts like he knows what he's doing and hey, we happen to believe him. Once you begin to implement these ideas into your online site, you'll find that the biggest problem you'll have is finding a server large enough to handle all the traffic. When that happens, give us a shout. You might get lucky enough to have us do a show on you and your success. And that's another daily idea. Are you looking for the newest and best business content on the web? Dailyhub.com covers topics ranging from marketing and finance to sales and strategy. Are you looking for an edge in business? Visit dailyhub.com today.